video I'm gonna share with you one of the most powerful thing that I've learned in the past eight months that has made the most incredible difference in my life there is no way that I would be able to achieve what I've been able to achieve in the past eight months if it wasn't for this single uh, habit that I've performed and this habit is not coming from me it's coming from the author of this book Napoleon Hill from the book the law of success what I discovered if you were to ask me Sean what is the one thing that I can do in my business or in my achievement of my goal that's going to uh, that's going to be the most powerful thing that's going to be the 20 percent that makes the 80 percent of difference what is that one thing what's that one condition and I would say I would say this talking to a group of people group of six to ten people on a weekly basis in an intimate setting with people who have three characteristics one they must be in the same exact business or they must have the same outcome specifically as to I want to have two they must be in spirit of full harmony there should not be any spirit of lack scarcity or fear and holding back and three, there has to be commitment. They have to show up on time and they have to show up consistently or else they get eliminated. So there has to be a really strict leadership and rules. And when I, when I discovered this, first when I heard about the principal mastermind a long time ago, uh, I was like, well, yeah, mastermind, I've already done this. You know, I already had a few different group of people that I used to talk to on a regular basis and we used to help each other. And of course, that was helpful. But the breakthrough came this year when I read this book in a new way. You know when sometimes you read something and it just kind of stands out in a different way, but you've already heard it before? This was the difference for me. I was like, what is Napoleon trying to talk about here? What is this thing about the mastermind group? And I discovered is that, what I discovered is that all my masterminds in the past, it was about people with different goals. We all had our own businesses. Well, I was in a personal training business or a, the other person was in a nutrition business, another person was in an online marketing business. But because there were so many different goals, we weren't in harmony in our minds as full as we could be. So with this new mastermind that I created a few, uh, eight months ago, every single person had one goal and the goal was to become a successful self-publisher on Amazon and to become financially free. That was, the, that was our goal. That was the goal and we had the same approach. And that was the first thing. Second thing is that we uh, decided that we would not allow anyone in the group who didn't share our values, not just our financial values, but our spiritual values. So we all believe in God and higher power and we all, we all in harmony in that. This is big because unless we believe in the same thing, we believe in abundance, we don't believe in scarcity, limitations, but we live in abundant life, we won't be able to connect to each other like a family. You know how when you talk to someone, you just feel like this person is like your brother? That's the feeling we have. And of course, this the feeling develops as time goes on. And the third thing is that, uh, one thing that one thing I did different with this mastermind is that we had no tolerance for lack of commitment. Uh, I created this mastermind without any price. The only price was to play full out and, and show up on time and show up consistently. We set our group at 9 a.m. in Friday. It was 8 p.m. Pacific time, which is pretty early for most people to wake up on a Friday morning and get up on a call at 8 a.m. by a group of people. <laughs> but I think this really showed who is serious and who is not serious. And uh, we had a few people who were making a lot of good money online, but they just weren't able to show up on time on this call and they just didn't seem like they have the, the enthusiasm as we share to show up on the call consistently. So they just kind of moved on to different things and that was perfect. And, but basically what happens is the people who are meant to be, they kind of stay and people who aren't, they get weeded out. And we create this amazing group. And to just give you an inspiration, every single person who joined our group has tripled their income in the past six to eight months. This is a fact, this is not a fiction we literally tripled our income and not only that we tripled our goals so if our goal was to make let's say ten thousand dollars per month back then now each person's goal on average to make thirty fifty eighty thousand dollars per month so not only our, our income increased our confidence increased our goals increased and the same thing is going to happen to you if you take and act exactly what i'm about to tell you so if you're inspired by this video and you want to apply it, here's what you do, exact step by step. It's the easiest thing, it only takes a few seconds, but what it only takes is courage and initiative. 
Again, initiative is another thing that Napoleon talks about in this book. Um, it's the power to just boldly act and just act as if, act with certainty. And the way he goes about it is, the way I went about it is that basically I start connecting to people through a Facebook group of common interest. So if you're in a, let's say, a personal trainer, you want to join a group with personal trainers who are all talking about the personal training businesses. If you're in the self-publishing business, I suggest you join groups that are self-publishing people talking to each other who have the shared values, share the same values. Then what I do is I message few people who I feel are givers. You can see by people's posts, people share stuff and they have positive attitude. And some people you can tell that they're coming from ego and how I'm better than you, etc. So we want to avoid those people. And we just message people who we feel they're, they're givers. And then we just kind of say, hey, listen, I was really impressed by this post that you had. I wanted to suggest we get on a call together and we do a 30 minute each. And we'll, I just want to know about your background, your goals and challenges, and we'll just do a little mastermind together. You can also refer them to this book saying that you learned this from this book. And most people are very receptive and people who aren't, they it just aren't meant to be. And what we do, what I do is I usually get on the call, I connect to them, we make friends. Then what I do is I set a day and I create a Facebook group, invite one person to the group. Now you have a group. Now there's two of you. It's perfect. And then we start our calls on the same day. Then we go about and inviting more people. We'll say, listen, we have a small group of people. We only align so many people in. It's going to be very exclusive of people who are very committed like yourself. And we invite more people to the group. Then we get on a call on a Friday and we use Google Hangout for this purpose. Google Hangout is so easy to use. All you got to do is to go to plus.google.com slash hangout slash active. You literally got to do that. And then there's two things. There's the Google Hangout on Air and Google Hangout. You don't want to do Air. You want to do Hangout because Hangout is just a small room. All you do, you open up Google Hangout. You take the link from the top of the page and you post it on the Facebook group that you already created and you have everyone join the group at a certain time. And then we just get on the call and the way we do our call and the reason I'm going into details right now is because somebody asked me so I, I want to give full details and the way we do our mastermind group that has really worked well so far is that we start the call with an expression of gratitude. The reason we do this is because by becoming harmonious to the source of wealth, we become more, we attract more of the wealth to us and by expressing gratitude, we get aligned with the source, creator, our God. And then once we do that, each person shares their, what they're grateful for. And we also share our definite chief aim, which is and a whole chapter on here. It talks about what is a definite chief aim. But in short, definite chief aim is our 90 day goals in a specific sentence that we share boldly. And we'll just go around the group. We share our goals. We share what we're grateful for. And then we just have a discussion. Hey, last week, here's what I discovered, guys. We ask, what are your challenges? What are your problems? We share, we talk, we laugh, we joke. And it's just so much fun. I mean, one of the things about online marketing that sucks is how you just sit at home all day in your front of your computer and you don't, you know, or in coffee shops. But it's kind of lonely. It's a lonely path compared to like people who go to offices. They at least interact with people. And we are people of, uh, we are just humans want to interact with each other, right? So by having a group where every week we get together and we interact and we laugh and we have fun, it's just so much fun. I mean, in our group, we have people from Israel, from Mexico, from United States. We all get together all over the world <laughs> and we just grow together. The other reason that I love a mastermind group is that it really, uh, it creates a new state of mind. Like it creates enthusiasm. It creates this boldness, this certainty that my goals is inevitable. I mean, I talk to my friend Carla, for example, and she tells me that she made 30 grand last month. I have this sense, it's like a fire rising from within. You know, there's like jealousy and there's this inspiration. It's kind of a close line, except it's different point of view. Jealousy says this person has more than me, so um, you want to hate them for it. But inspiration says this person has more than me. I can do the same thing and good for them and bless them. May they have even more. So when, when we talk to each other and my mastermind shares their goals, I have this fire inside of me that I used to call my competitive nature. Now I call my inspiration nature <laughs> and I get so inspired. I get happy for them. I help them even more and I send thanks to my creator for blessing them because I know I'm also going to get blessed because if they could have it, so can I. And they're so generous with their time and, and their sharing and they share their techniques and their methods. And then uh, we just kind of grow together. So that's another reason that I love masterminds. The third reason that a mastermind is a must if you really want to reach success is that uh, 
is that by having a group of people who are committed showing up on time every single time and there's a commitment in place, I can't just wake up and say, I don't want to show up today. I don't want to go because I don't feel like it. It really makes me to think about my business on a regular basis and taking actions. We also have a daily huddle where we mastermind with each other on a daily basis. We grow together, we share. It's just an incredible experience. But everything I said doesn't mean anything if you, unless you try it. So I hope you try this method. And the first step is connect with another person that you relate to, start a Facebook group, set a date for a Google Hangout, and just get on the call and start interacting and watch the magic take place. I wanna also finish by saying, if you have any questions that you want me to share, anything that you feel like you want me to elaborate more or share more stories, I love to be of service and to inspire you or help you in any way that I can. So please go ahead and post it and I'll make sure to include it in my upcoming videos. Thank you for watching this video. Have a great day.